Hello students. In the previous lecture video of engineering mechanics, we had discussed about moment of inertia. So we had started this uh, new chapter. We had understood the meaning of inertia. So inertia means the reluctance of uh, an object against the state of rest or uniform motion. And uh, moment of inertia means it is the resistance against moment. In the last part of the video, I had uh, discussed about two types of systems. First one was discrete system, and second one was continuous system. So, in today's class, uh, we shall discuss about uh, two types of moment of inertia. Uh, first one is uh, area moment of inertia. Second one is mass moment of inertia. Okay. And uh, A represents 
the radius of ligation it is the radius of ligation what is radius of ligation it is nothing but the distance of the area from the reference axis okay so here if we have to find out the moment of uh, uh, inertia with respect to x axis we can find it out as ixx equals to
and assume that its distance from x axis be y and its distance from y axis so take it y1 is x1 so its moment of inertia with respect to x axis will be area multiplied with square of distance from reference axis so its distance from reference axis x is y1 so its square is y1 square and if uh, we have to find out the moment of inertia of the entire area then we will take the integration so this will be y1 square dA and we have to integrate so this is the way we can find out the moment of inertia for a continuous system Similarly, we can find out the moment of inertia of y y axis by taking the integration of x1 square d. Now, we will see the next type of uh, area moment of inertia because depending upon the three reference axes, we will be having three types of area moment of inertia. We have uh, discussed about the moment of inertia about x axis and y y axis. Next, we will see the moment of inertia with respect to z axis. Shot. 
and I am fixing it at one end and I am applying a moment. So if the polar moment of inertia is high, then this shaft won't get twisted. This shaft will not get twisted. If its polar moment of inertia or its moment of inertia about jet chain axis is low, then this shaft will get twisted. So uh, with this uh, we shall uh, close today's uh, session. In the next video we shall discuss about mass moment of inertia.